Hey guys, what's going on? Cody Gertz here and welcome to another video right here on my channel. And today I'm going to be showing you guys how to uh, protect your frame from scratches. You know, maybe uh, you'd like to do some gravel riding or, you know, a little bit of trail riding like I do uh, with my giant talon here. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to protect your frame on a budget, okay? So you don't need to go out and buy $25 frame tape. Um, I'm actually going to be doing it with Gorilla Tape today, so just uh, let's go ahead and get into this video. So first off, some of the most common areas for frame tape, you know, where you need to protect your frame, are right up here where the cable rubs, okay, right up here where your stem comes through, where this cable rubs right here is normally where, you know, you could put tape upon turning and stuff like that, okay, but today we're actually going to be covering the underside of the main frame, okay, so we're going to be putting tape on the other side of the, of the main frame. Now this bike already comes with a chain guard, okay, so right here, as you can see, um, on this back arm, they already have from stock a chain guard. So if you're riding some rough roads, this chain will come down and hit the top of that. Okay, so they've already provided that. And I think stock is like they use a company or a tape called Lizard Skins. Very expensive stuff, super high quality and seamless edges, but um, like I said, super duper expensive. So today, uh, let's go ahead. Um, wait, there is one more area. And that's right here um, coming down from the seat stem okay so this main frame right here um, also gets a lot of abuse from this rear tire throwing rocks at it and stuff like that okay so those are just some common areas but like I said today we're gonna be focusing on the bottom of the main frame all right let's go ahead and get into it okay so we're gonna start with Gorilla Tape okay this is a very strong super adhesive clear tape okay um, and I think it's six dollars at the store is what I bought it for so this is the tape that we're going to be using on the bottom of our frame okay today now this is a very flexible tape um, and it conforms to just about any curvature okay so it makes it a very easy application for the bottom of the frame okay now the next step you need to do is get a baby wipe and wipe down the bottom of the frame okay this is going to remove all the dust all the dirt all the mud all the oils all that good stuff um, and then also, if you do still find oil on there, you can use like an acetone or a nail polish remover, okay? And at this point, what you need to do is flip your bike over. So once you have your bike stabilized, you can go ahead and start applying the tape, okay? Start near the stem, start in the middle of the tape and apply the center of the tape all the way down the center of the bottom of the frame, okay? And you can run your thumb down it, make sure there's no air bubbles, you're gonna run your fingers down it, pressing firmly, um, and it'll actually conform to the edges around the frame, okay? And once you get up near the pedals, where the pedal, uh, the bottom bracket there, you're actually going to press even harder around the welds and make sure there are no air bubbles, okay? And just simply, going through the frame just like that all right and here is the finished product okay it didn't turn out too bad um, and this is my first application with Gorilla Tape very super thick tape high quality tape um, and it gives it a nice glossy finish even making it look a little bit more stylish on the bottom while protecting your frame Hey guys, I hope you got some value from this video. Just follow those simple steps that I just walked you through and you guys should have no problems, okay? Just remember, watch out for air bubbles um, and make sure you get that frame nice and clean before you put the tape on, okay? Thanks for watching so much. And if you got some value out of this video, be sure to check out my other, other videos on the channel and subscribe so that way I can keep pumping videos out for you guys, all right? Thanks for watching and uh, peace out.